Hey, what's up, y'all? So I hope that you're having an awesome day. And today, I'm doing this. I'm so absolutely in love with the way that this turned out. Um, I just... Yeah, I absolutely love it. I hope that you like it too. If you do end up liking this video, make sure that you give me a thumbs up and subscribe. Hit the notification bell. And I'm going to go ahead and jump right into so, it. As you saw from my intro, we are going to um, do kind of like an anti-Valentine's Day look. And uh, that just means that if you're not into Valentine's Day, you don't have a Valentine or you just really don't care, then this is for you. Cha -cha. Yeah. Um, I think for um, this look, I'm going to be using the ABH Modern Renaissance Palette right here. So, I am going to prime with my MAC Stock Ochre Paint Pot. And this is just on a dry sponge. I am going to take my Modern Renaissance uh, palette from ABH, and I am going to go in with this shade right here, which is Love Letter, and I'm going to also mix um, a little bit of Burnt Orange with that as well. And I'm just going to take that on a very fluffy brush. So now that I have that blended out, I'm going to take a black kind of cream shadow. This one is just from LA Colors. NYX makes good uh, little jumbo pencils, but literally just grab any sort of cream black shadow. And I'm just going to put this all over my lid. You don't have to be super precise because we're going to be blending this out. And I'm going to grab a small blending brush like this. This is the JH37 brush. And I'm going to dip into a black eyeshadow. It doesn't matter. Any sort of black eyeshadow will do. And I'm going to start patting using circular motions, a little bit of windshield wipers, just anything to start to blend this out. But you want to start slow. Don't do it too, you know, much or else you'll have black all the way up to your eyebrows. And if you need to, you can grab an even smaller blending brush like this to kind of get into like this inner corner area. And now that I have this eye blended out with a black um, to a point that I like it right now, I'm going to go back in with this black cream just right here to my lid. And I'm going to grab a flat brush just like this, and I don't know if they still make these. Um, but you can use any shadow that's kind of similar to this. The L'Oreal Infallible Shadows, and this one is in Eternal Black. And I'm just going to pick it up on the brush. And I'm going to press that in to my lid. And this isn't going to add any, like, insane sparkle or anything, because this does have kind of like a, a glittery reflect in, in it, but it just adds more depth to the eye. And it also just kind of deepens it and adds a little bit of that shimmer to it. And I will apply this all over my eyelid to the outer corner as well. And the real star of the show for this look is the Urban Decay Heavy Metal Liner in the shade Midnight Cowboy. And I'm going to put this all over the inner portion of my lid, concentrating most of it to the inner corner. And then 
once the brush has a little bit less on it, I'm dragging it farther out. Ooh, that's my phone. And I'm gonna go ahead and use my Ico Skinny Liner in the shade black, and I'm going to line this eye over here. And coat my lashes with some mascara. All right, and while I'm waiting on my mascara to dry, I'm just going to grab a makeup wipe and clean off any of the fallout that might have happened underneath my eye. So really quick off camera, I am going to just throw on my foundation. For my primer, I'm gonna use my Revlon Photo Ready Pore Reducing Primer. And for my foundation today, I'm going to use the Cover FX Natural Finish Foundation, and mine is in the shade N10. Okay, so I went ahead and applied my foundation, my concealer, my powders, and I have not done the rest of my face yet because I wanna do that with you. But before we do that, I'm going to finish up my eyes. I'm going to take my gel liner and go ahead and line my waterline and my tight line. Taking a very small blender brush, I am going to go in with the shade Love Letter. And I'm going to really blend this out on my lower lash line. I really want this to be super smoky, super blown out. And I'm going to run that along that kind of liner edge, so it kind of softens that as well. So now taking a flat kind of liner brush like this, I'm going to dip in to a black eyeshadow and then just stamp this along my lower lash line. I'm going to take my glitter liner from Urban Decay and I'm going to hit that just right here on the very inner part of my lower lash line. And now to load up my lower lashes with a ton of mascara. All right, so we are almost done. I'm going to zoom you out real quick, and we are going to finish the face. For my bronzer, I'm going to go in with my Butter Bronzer from Physicians Formula. My blush today is the Milani Rose Blush in the shade Blossom Time Rose. And for my highlight, my current obsession, which is the Wet n Wild Loose Highlight in I'm So Lit. So right now my skin is very broken out and irritated because I was trying, um, it was actually a Mederma product, um, to help fade my acne scars because you can use it on your face and my face has broken out so bad because of it. I mean a lot of um, my blemishes are gone but it's still pretty like broken up. You can see there all of his, that, this thing. I had breakouts on my chin like it was all over the place so of course a product that I use to fade scars makes me break out so thanks for that. And for my lips today, I'm going to go in with the L'Oreal Infallible Pro Matte Liquid Lip in the shade Dose of Coco. I'm going to go over that with a little bit of Dose of Colors Lazy Daisy.
a V-Red mix. And now to finish off the look with a little bit of Catrice Prime and Fine Illuminating Setting Spray. That is it for today. The look is complete and um, I love it. This is one of my absolute favorite looks that I've done on myself in a long time. Like I'm so in love with the way that this looks. It just feeds my soul. <laughs> um, so this is perfect for your anti-Valentine's Day look or even your Valentine's Day look if you like to really amp up the drama like me. Um, or maybe just, you know, the average Wednesday going to the grocery store. I hope that you liked it and found this helpful or enjoyable. If you do want to see more from me, make sure that you hit the subscribe button and hit the notification bell. I post new videos every single Tuesday at 6 p.m. Central Time. And I will see you in the next one. Bye. Where is my brush? That's not the brush.